What is up, data homies? It is your boy, Justin Bassetti, back again with another Theta Token video, another Theta Token update. Just a friendly reminder, if you're new to the channel, trying to find as much Theta news, updates, NFTs, or any kind of Theta partnerships, definitely please hit that like and subscribe button. Definitely check out all the links down below in the description for all the links I post in this video, along with my match and replay referral link if you are trying to earn as much TNT20 token, especially on the Theta blockchain. So thanks for coming back to the channel, guys. If you're an OG viewer and subscriber, going on to the current price of Theta, we'll start there and then go on to the news like we normally do so seeing on the theta explorer page here the current price is that 62 cent mark for theta as well as t fuel at that three cent mark and t drop at that 0 0.0013 mark so as always we'll see and stay tuned for the new updates in terms of the pricing like i say always none of these videos are financial advice and i never really do price predictions on the channel just because we never really know what may or may not happen so going off of that we're going to go on to twitter seeing that imagine replay says continues to grow check out their latest over the top channel beyond tv lifestyle travel shows cooking and more so check that out especially down below like i said that imagine replay referral link it is free for those who are trying to earn as much tnt 20 token on that theta blockchain going on to a little bit more on the crypto insider seeing meta film 3 fest theta theta and theta film 3 going on to this actual tweet seeing what is up theta fam Word on the street is Theta Network and the squad is something up or coming up to something. So here's a little something something. It looks like Medicaid Films 3. I believe this happened. I feel like this happened kind of recently in terms of 2023, but I could be wrong. I feel like this happened around maybe end of the summer. So around maybe July, June, August, around there. I know it's September in the making of this video, but we will see in terms of what else is more to come. We do know that Jordan Bain will be going to Theta Con of 2023, who was, I believe, affiliated with the Medicaid Film Festival or maybe it doesn't say Medicaid's it says Meta Film 3 Fest so a little different in terms of actual event I do want to correct myself there because we do see that Theta the Squad Film 3 Summit and Medicaid's right here Film 3 and then presents the Film 3 Fest October 27th to November 5th of 2023 coming soon I don't know where the exact location is but we do know that I believe early November beginning week of November that is where ThetaCon will be held and hosted I'm not too sure if this will incorporate ThetaCon or this film fest into ThetaCon I should say maybe that'd be a nice spontaneous type of thing just to have more people incorporated on the Theta the event ThetaCon itself into Theta Network just the whole umbrella of the whole blockchain that type of platform but we will see and then it says coming soon so i'm sure we'll have more news and updates as to when this will be announced going on to a little bit more seeing that verified labs who is a part of theta network who has released theta drop on their nft projects i believe it was the steve mcqueen nft drop who has been a part of this affiliated with this overall project seeing that justin trevor winter says trying to comply with sec rules and regulations is like trying to hit a moving target co-founder and ceo of web3 film studio verified labs told decrypt going on to this little article we're not going to read the entirety of it just to save us some time seeing right here this paragraph right here due to the sec's current tight-lipped approach to crypto regulation it may not be known for some time if the agency's regulatory appetite is so expansive but the uncertainty and fear stirred by its actions against stoner cats this is what this nft project is so it's referring to that one but also you can insert almost any other nft project here it's almost certain to see beyond the tight-knit ecosystem of nft backed media projects many build as film three projects so of course we know as of the making of this video currently in 2023 of september there is a lot of regulation that needs to be made in terms of crypto especially nft projects there's been a lot of rugs in a sense rugs not only within the crypto community in general but also in terms of theta a lot of projects that may not have been kept up to their promises just because unfortunately that's just where it's kind of like the wild west the next elevation in terms of the next step or place you can say humans are trying to aim towards you can say that early of the early 2000s you can say amazon you can say google things like that also we never know these things like crypto in general will be successful that's what i try to compare it to just because we're so early in to this agile atmosphere but like i said none of these videos are financial advice definitely do your own research before investing it's just something that i related to just because that's just my own perception of what is happening especially when it comes to ai things like that i believe these type of models will replace current structures to make certain work styles easier but that is just my perception just because i, I work in healthcare but we also see that la vida has partnered with epic just to see some sort of trial run to try and gather some information i'm assuming that's the 
reason why that partnership between La Vida and Epic, the electronic medical records is Epic. So they can join those two and see where that type of dynamic can lead to maybe better ecosystems, better functionality for not only just patients and doctors or not just only doctors, but also between patients and doctors and other type of researchers. But that's definitely my own thoughts in terms of the current status of crypto and AI. Definitely comment down below what your guys' own opinion is on that in terms of crypto, AI, or anything in the future that you think that we are working towards in terms of as a society. But that's enough of that type of article. Going on to a little another update, seeing that LaVita posted, we are thrilled to announce a brilliant addition to LaVita Advisory Council, Dr. Syed Hassanpour, Professor of Biomedical Data Science, Computer Science, and Epidemiology, Founding Director of Dartmouth Center for Precision Health and Artificial Intelligence at Geisel School of Medicine at Dartmouth College, has joined the LaVita Advisory Council. Welcome on board, Dr. Hazanpour. So as you can tell, here's that type of article. Definitely check out those links down below. We'll dive into a little bit as well. It looks like about a three minute read posted on September 26th of 2023. This was the introduction that was posted on this tweet. Dr. Hazanpour is not only a pioneer in the field of precision health and artificial intelligence, but also the driving force behind the renowned Hazanpour lab. Here's that hyperlink and the Dartmouth Center for Precision Health and Artificial Intelligence. Join us as we extend a warm welcome to this visionary scholar and explore his remarkable journey. This goes all together in terms of his background. Dr. Syed Hazanpour is an accomplished scholar and visionary in the fields of biomedical science and AI. With a PhD in electrical engineering and a deep understanding in biomedical informatics from Stanford University, he has made a significant contributions to the world of precision health. His journey from Stanford University to his current role as an associate professor at the Geisel School of Medicine at Dartmouth College is marked by groundbreaking research and commitment to transforming healthcare. Precision health as a focus. One cannot discuss Dr. Hazenpour's contributions without mentioning the Hazenpour lab. Under his guidance, this interdisciplinary research lab has become a symbol of innovation excellence. The lab's primary mission is to develop cutting edge computational methodologies and intelligent tools for analyzing complex biomedical data. The lab's dedication to precision health is evident in its multifaceted research areas, which encompass digital pathology, medical imaging, clinical and text mining, and multimodal AI. Through these avenues, the strive to unlock and valuable insights from the world of biomedical data. Transforming cancer diagnosis and care, one of the standout achievements of Hazenpour Lab is the pioneering work in precision cancer diagnosis and care. They have harnessed the power of deep learning and enhanced the accuracy of cancer diagnosis and identifying novel biomarkers. Their research transcends specific cancer types offering hope to patients and clinical alike. A center of excellence, Dr. Hazenpour's visionary leadership extends beyond the lab. He is also the founding director of the Dartmouth Center for Precision Health and Artificial Intelligence, interdisciplinary research Research Center is driving force behind the advancement of precision health. It leverages AI and machine learning to analyze complex biomedical data, ultimately improving public health and healthcare delivery. This organization's commitment to ethical AI aligns perfectly with Dr. Hazenpour's vision. They understand the importance of responsible AI use, ensuring the benefits of AI are accessible to everyone, regardless of their background or circumstances. Shaping the future of healthcare, we are fortunate to welcome Dr. Hazenpour as an advisor to LaVita AI. His expertise and visionary leadership are invaluable assets that will guide us towards groundbreaking advancements in healthcare and artificial intelligence. With Dr. Hazenpour's insights, we are poised to create a brighter, healthier future for all, where technology and innovation will lead us toward improved healthcare. So overall, that is the synopsis or the entire article in itself. So definitely comment down below what you guys think. It does make sense in terms of having this individual a part of the team, having that focus, especially research based in terms of, I know his focus is cancer diagnosis and treatments, but that is the whole premise of LaVita, gathering information, this type of information and distribute it to appropriate crowds and individuals who may share certain characteristics and issues and problems like this cancer diagnosis. But we are still definitely really early especially when it comes to this and not only type of AI but healthcare and AI together that's just my own opinion as well definitely comment down below what your guys own thoughts are in terms of healthcare and AI if they belong together if they will work out together in a sense I do believe they will but this will take a long time in terms of actually funding it not only for the public but also just starting up in general but that is all I really have for today's video guys definitely comment down below what your guys thoughts are in terms of the video itself what you would like me to cover in the next future videos that I plan on posting but if you're an OG viewer and subscriber thank you so much for coming back to the channel really do appreciate it if you're a new viewer definitely please hit that like and subscribe button definitely check out all the links down below in the description for all the links I post in this video along with my imagine replay referral link if you're trying to earn as much TNT 20 token especially on the theta blockchain but until the next video until the next theta update it is your boy Justin Bassetti so try to keep up hi
Deuces.